So I guess here I am again making more videos to more naysayers. As you can see, here's my PSP and my PSP to TV base station. And as you can see clearly it says 2.71 SEB. There you go. Alright, moving back the camera so that you can still see. And I'm going to talk through the whole entire process just so nobody can say, oh look, he's cheating or altering the movie in any way, shape, or form. Oh my, this again. So here we go, let's try first. We're going to use the demo disc, demo UMD, and we're going to use SOCOM, and we're going to use Killzone, and I'm going to use GTA. And we'll see which ones work today. Demo UMD goes into the back of the PSP, over the game menu, up the volume nice and loud so everybody can hear, grab GTA, and my hand's still in the video so that you can see that I'm not cutting it. Not pressing any buttons, no tricks behind or anything like that. There you have it, here it comes. GTA. So, that's confirmation enough for me. Confirmation enough for most of you, I hope. Let's try to try to, and just to make sure, so I'm not sh using 2.8 or anything like that or uh, spoofing. As you can see, what does it say? Need to update to 2.81. Do I want to update? No, of course not. There you go. 2.81. Need it. Okay, so. Out goes GTA. Let's throw. What was that? The demo disc. Killzone Liberation. Demo disc that I got out of PlayStation Magazine. Which I have not tried before. So let's pop that in. Wait for that to come up. Grab GTA and have it ready. Killzone needs a 2.71 update. Starts up. Let me demo. I have to be gentle. And my hand's still in the video. Moving the PSP around so that if I was to try and alter it, you would see definite jumps in the frame skip if you slowed it down. And it works using the Killzone Liberation demo disc. Okay, confirmation enough for me. There you go. Now we're going to try it using GTA. And again, I'll give you proof that you need to update. By running, hitting X again from the main menu. Without removing Vice City Stories. See? Need an update. Okay. Now I'm not going to update. Out comes Vice City Stories. In comes Liberty City Stories. And it's quite damaged as you can see. So I'm not sure it's a bit tight. But we'll try anyways. Price City Stories again. GTA, Liberty City Stories coming up now. Hit X. The yellow bar goes away. Pop out the game. Pop in Vice City Stories. And let's see if this works. And I think it will. Pretty sure it's taking about the right time. Vice City Stories using Liberty City Stories. There we go. Okay, what other games do I have here that I can try? Oh, wait, SOCOM. So I try SOCOM? I'm not sure. I've been doing, doing this so many times now, it is not funny. I don't know why people dispute it, but videos don't lie. Especially when I'm talking the whole way through and doing multiple demos of the same technique and getting it every single time. Still don't know why in fact it won't work. And again, after restarting, it says I need to update. No, I'm not going to update. Because I am going to do my 
Candice bait and switch. The new bait and switch for 2.8 plus plus games on 2.71 S E Special Edition version B PSPs. And maybe 2.71. I'm not sure. Maybe I'll downgrade and upgrade and do it again. Downgrade and re-upgrade to this. Yellow ball disappears. Pop out the disc. Pop in Vice City Stories. And I'm still talking. Join the whole video so no one can dispute that it's one continuous video all the way through. No, stop talking. Here comes Vice City Stories. Right now. <laughs> so there you have it. Four different discs that all work.